Go on ahead. I need a rest for a bit. Who is that? And why do I feel so warm all of a sudden? I can't... look away. Don't... don't touch me! You refuse my gift? y, y yes <laughs> Why are you doing this? Because it's there. I... I won't be another victim. Triana, you're back. Yeah, it's me. You healed up quickly. Yeah, well, I couldn't stand another day in the hospital, so I decided to check myself out. They let you do that? I wouldn't say let. More like they accepted my demands. Ha! <laughs> That's funny, LT. I'm serious. <clears throat> well then. Listen, we've got a mission of the utmost importance. What is it? We've just lost contact with Alpine Echo. We're being sent in to investigate it. Alpine Echo? There's an SCP located at the top of Mount Everest. Alpine Echo is the mobile task force that's stationed there. So we're going to Mount Everest? Yes. Will we be climbing it? If the mission requires us to. Well, you can just count me out. No way am I going up that high. Corey, are you afraid of heights? No, I'm afraid of falling from heights. Isn't that essentially the same thing? No, it's completely different. Anyways, if need be, we will be tasked with containing SCP-1529. Is it really that dangerous? Considering we just lost contact with the base that was supposed to monitor it, yes. So how are we going to catch it? With bait. You didn't tell me it would be this cold. Did I have to? It would have been nice. Let's go inside. See if we can't find some answers. Let's move. Hey, Triana? Yes, Corey? Remember to stay frosty. Ugh, not cool, Corey. Yeah, I guess that was a bit cold of me. Cut the chatter. My God, this is horrible. SCP-1529 must have attacked. How does that work? I still don't really know what we're going up against. SCP-1529 is a humanoid figure that stalks the peak of Mount Everest for its victims. Then why did it come here? According to the file, if you lock eyes with it, you'll become hypnotized. You will start to die of hypothermia shortly after if you're not treated, and the SCP will track you down after making eye contact. Oh, that sounds familiar. So someone in the base must have made eye contact with it. 
This is very strange. I've never heard about it going so far out its own zone. Well, it's a mystery for the ages. Might as well go home. Not so fast, Corey. You know what needs to be done. Okay, but can I please not be the bait? Okay, Hooper can be the bait. I humbly accept the role as bait. (laughs) Whatever, I can do it humbly if I wanted to. Let's move out, we're burning daylight. So are we going to have to climb the entire mountain? Yes, Corey, we don't have rocket boots to get up there. (sighs) Okay. According to the altimeter, we are just about to pass the 8,000 meter mark. Already? We've been hiking for days, Corey. Man, time just flies by when I just don't think. Really, Corey? What? Sometimes I just don't know about you. Anyways, let's keep going. I'll climb ahead to see if I can draw it out. Hmm, this cold wind, it reminds me. Of what? SCP-990 once told me of cold winds approaching. Maybe this is what he was talking about. Hey, Corey, I've been meaning to ask you something. Yes, this hair is all natural. That's not what I was going to ask. What do you think of Lara? Well, she's really important to the team. She's invaluable. Why? Uh, I don't know. I thought I saw something between you two. Like romantically? Yeah. Oh, well then, uh, never really thought about her like that. Hold that thought. Where's Hooper? Good question. Hooper! Shush, you're gonna cause an avalanche. Crap, you're right. Wait, over there. I'm coming, buddy! What? What's happening? The SCP had you. I'm... I'm so cold. Whoa. I feel... Nice. Almost warm. Corey, snap out of it! What? Wait. Hey! You're the SCP we need to capture. Not so fast! That was close. Too close. We need to get off this mountain before it returns. Right. Maybe we could get a helicopter up here. Already on its way. Lara? You've been listening to us? (laughs) Maybe. You and I are going to have a talk when I get back to base. Ah oh, man, does this hot tub feel good? Hooper? Yeah, you don't mind if I join you, do you? No, it's just... Well, Hooper, you still have your helmet on. You're not thinking tactically, Cor. You gotta be ready at all times. I guess. I'd rather be caught with my pants down than my helmet off.
Right. Triana? You don't mind me, right? Well, no, I guess more the merrier. Oh, in that case, come on in, Lara. Hey, guys. Look at us, just one big happy Alpha Strike family. Yeah, that's us. I'm just glad we've all made it this long together. Yeah, I've had a lot of soldiers come and go. You've probably been the best squad I've ever had. Aww. Probably. <laughs> Whatever the Foundation throws at us next, we'll be ready. Right. <laughs> 